Hi, have you ever wanted to create a more convincing cleavage but you're not sure how to? Well, stay tuned and I'll take you through it step by step. Okay, so what we're going to do today is create a cleavage using some simple products such as surgical spirits, some sports injury tape, a pair of relatively cheap enhancers, and of course everybody's favourite enhancer bra. So, let's get this underway. First thing we need to do to make the tape stick really well is to ensure we remove most of the oils from our skin. So take a little bit of surgical spirits and just wipe them along the area where the tape is going to adhere, like so. Set. Now I've already cut some of this tape, forgive the colour, it's a bit of a gaudy blue, it comes in various colours. I've cut this around about 25 centimetres long and it's very flexible this tape. All we need to do is take the backing off of it. Let me come in about 5 centimetres to start with, you can see the very, very flexible stuff. Touch it just under the arm here, like so, making sure it's really well adhered here. Now I'm going to pull my chest muscles together quite tightly. This, as you can see, this is starting to really sort of stretch now. I can pull it around as low as I can get it and attach it on the other side. Take the backing tape off, make sure it's in a nice position. Now it's firmly held there. You can see it. At the bottom here, I'm just going to pinch that together, like so. So that's the part one, the physical side of it all there. Make sure it's all nicely done like that. Now what we can do is just pop on our favourite enhancer bra. You can see here it's got some cushioning inside of it. Underneath what would be your normal Rest area giving it a bit of lift. This one's a 38B, I think it is. So I'm just going to pop that one on. Like so. And pop that over. Just put it in. I'm just going to pull these a little bit more into place. There, so we're getting quite a, a large sort of cleavage around this area here. Now, if you need a little bit more, you can get these enhancers in various sizes. You can even pick them up somewhere fairly cheaply in Primark. Just pop them inside. Give it a little bit of extra lift if we need it. Pull it up into position. So if you keep working this blue tape or the tape down here a little bit more, you can generally get it underneath the band. So that's the basic bit now. So that's part one. So that's very, very simple. It only takes a minute or two to get that in position. Just keep popping it into place. And enhance it a little bit more. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a little bit of contour makeup here for part two, where I'm just going to make sure that the eye line is taken down into the cleavage area here. So I'm just going to take a little bit of a break off camera, get the bits and pieces together, and then I'm going to come back and show you how to do that. Welcome back. So what we're going to do is a little bit of contouring makeup here, just to enhance a little bit. I've got in this brush here, I've got the Crolon Shade 9W, so it's quite a dark colour here. And what I'm going to do is emphasise the bit in the centre of the cleavage and bring it around and up above the bust. And the same here, around and up above the bust. So we're creating like a W area in there. And then I'm just going to blend that in. See that's about lining it a little bit more. And work that in until it blends in a little bit better with the rest of the chest line here. I'm just doing this as a quick exercise here. I'm trying to look down like this is not that easy to be honest. 
The second colour I'm going to do is a lighter colour, and this is a 2W. I'm going to take that just below the darker colour that's created here. Again, we just need to blend that in. I'm going to then go back to my matte mineralized skin finish just to give it a little bit of a pop on it. Just make it stand out a little bit more. So the lighter area here, just apply a little bit, work it in so it catches the light a little bit more. That's good there. So hopefully now you can see bust area around here, the cleavage is quite pronounced. So what I'm going to do now is just find an appropriate top. So hopefully you can see that a little bit better there. All right, so I've just added a very simple top with a zip up front to it, which also helps to pull the bust line around a little bit. And this is the cleavage we can create. It only takes a couple of minutes. Um, it's worth the time and the practice. It has a very good effect. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to subscribe and like and uh, comment below. So thank you very much.